It is now time for oral questions. I recognize the Leader of His Majesty's Loyal Opposition. Speaker, my question to the Premier. Yesterday was an historic victory for Ontario workers. The courts recognized that 800,000 public sector workers and New Democrats have been saying for years that Bill 124 was unconstitutional. That was affirmed by the courts. Bill 124 is unconstitutional. This is a hard-fought and long-overdue victory for workers who deserve a government that will respect this decision and work with them to move forward. Why won't the Premier respect the court ruling and stop appealing yet another court loss for this government? To reply, the Attorney General. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And I think the, the member opposite knows that we're reviewing the, the decision. We intend to appeal, and, and so I can't comment further upon uh, comment there. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Order. Supplementary question. Speaker, we have seen the consequences of this government's wage restraint across the public sector, but nowhere have the effects been more acute than in our health care sector, where Bill 124 has directly contributed to our province's current health care crisis. Given yesterday's ruling, will the government finally admit that Bill 124 has had a negative impact on our health care system? Respond, the President of the Treasury Board. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Speaker. As the Attorney General said, we are reviewing this decision. Our intention is to appeal, but we will speak to our investments uh, in health care, and especially in health human resources. Since March of 2020, we have added over 12,000 health care professionals to the system. Just this year alone, the Ontario Colleges of Nurses has registered over 12,800 nurses just this year. And we still have two months to go. Mr. Speaker, we will continue to make these historic investments to support health care uh, workers and the delivery of health care services all across this province. And the final supplementary, the member for Sudbury. Thank you, Speaker. Speak 